It's Timu Tuesday time! Hi everyone, welcome to our Crazy Life Scotland. My name's Fiona and this is my favourite time of the week. Timo Tuesday... Timo? Timo Tuesday time means it is time for a Timo haul. And if you've been here for any length of time, you will know how much I love Timu. I want to start by saying I have paid for all of this with my own pennies. However, I am part of the Timu Influencer Programme, which means I will have a link in the description of all my videos, which will take you direct to the Timu app. And if you use that, you can get a wonderful coupon build building. Oh my goodness, I can't speak today. A wonderful coupon bundle. Sorry about that, I was interrupted because my neighbour's dog had escaped. <laughs> Where was I? Yeah, if you use that link you will get a coupon bill. Oh, I keep wanting to say building bundle. And also, if you use the discount code that's in my description, if you're a brand new team user, you will get up to 50% off. Uh, this is actually a panic buy. I've got no idea what I bought because I suddenly realised that I wasn't waiting on anything from Timu, and I hate that. I always have to have something to look forward to from Timu. So I thought, I must place an order, I must place an order. And it was the middle of the night. And we all know I shouldn't place middle of the night orders because I never know what I'm going to end up with. So I have got no clue what is in here, and I will put all the prices on the screen. Let's get into it. Right, let's find out together what I bought. First thing out, oh, we have diamond painting stickers. Let's open this up. It's packaged a bit better than the last lot of diamond painting stickers. They were very creased. So, we have got, they are a wee bit creased. We have got our stickers. Oh, there's a lot of them. Look at all them. Woohoo! Yes, Christmas. If you're new here, I love Christmas crafts. Oh, and I've never made a nutcracker, so that will be interesting. Yeah! And I am thinking about doing something a little bit different with diamond paintings just now, so stay tuned to my videos to find out what that is. So we get the stickers, we get the drills, they're nice vibrant colours. Oh, we've got two toolkits for this one. I don't know if they meant that or not. <laughs> we have got two toolkits. It's a normal toolkit of a pen, a drill tray and the wax. Yay! Look forward to doing that. We have got, ooh, this is a window cling, I believe. Let me open it and have a look. Okay, ha ha ha, look. How cute. Oh, it's wrapped around some foam, which is good. Look at the snowman and the bauble. Look at Rudolph. The North Pole, a disco ball. There's quite a few snowflakes there. I don't know if, if the camera's picking them up. Oh, I didn't realise there was as many as this. Wow. I vaguely remember ordering this because I thought it's not specifically for my windows. I was wanting to try to use it in resin, but they're big. So there's not a lot of them that will be able to use in my resin, but I will think of something. Merry Christmas. Yeah, I like them. Let's have a quick look at the quality of them. I'll just roll them the other way and they'll go flat. I also wasn't sure if it was all one piece or separate, but it looks like they're separate, which is good. There we go. Yep, feels nice and stuck. Staticky, is that a word? <laughs> um, yeah, basically it's not sticky, so it'll cling to your window, but it won't leave any mess or marks, which is good. Yeah, looking forward to doing things with them. Next, we, oh, <laughs> I thought I had dreamt that I had bought one of these. <laughs> it's a pulse oximeter. Now, I used to be a nurse, so I know all about these. If you didn't, these basically go on your finger and they tell you your pulse rate and your 
the oxygen level in your blood. Now, how does it charge? Is it batteries, I take it? Yeah, so it won't work just now because it needs two AAA batteries. I will see, before when I'm editing this video, I'll see if I've got some uh, AAA batteries and if so, I'll try it for you to let you see. But basically, you do that, you pop your finger in there and it comes up on the screen what your pulse is and what the oxygen level is. Now, I have been waking up through the night with palpitations quite a lot recently. So I remember thinking to myself, oh, that would be handy to have for, you know, when I, I get the palpitations just to see what my pulse is doing. So I must have actually bought it. I honestly thought I was dreaming it. <laughs> um, it comes with instructions as well and a little wrist thing so that you don't drop it. It's a handy wee gadget. I didn't actually realise before seeing it on Timu that you can buy them at home. I've only ever used them in the hospital. Okay, so I've just put the batteries in and pressed the button to switch it on. I'm now going to put my finger in there, press this and see what happens. So my oxygen is 98%. Oh, 97, my goodness. I need to take deep breaths. Oh, my oxygen's falling. Help, I'm dying. <laughs> my pulse is 112. I have always got a high pulse. Not very happy with my oxygen levels. 94. Well, that's better. It's climbing again. It must just be reading it. But that's basically... How these work. Oh, that's better. Oh, thank goodness I've got oxygen in me. <laughs> I'm certainly full of hot air. There we go. So now if I'm having palpitations, I can put this on and see if my heart really is beating like it's trying to get out my chest or not. Hey, now we have another water bottle. Why did I buy this? I have got no idea why I bought this because this is the third one that I've bought. I bought one for Brooke and it was good but then she dropped her bag and it cracked at the bottom so it was leaking so then I bought one for myself which I've not actually used so I don't know why I bought this one as well hmm I must have had a reason at, a at the time maybe I was thirsty <laughs> I don't know I mean they're good little bottles don't get me wrong but hmm oh we've got another diamond painting what is this Oh, it's a Halloween one, look. It's all the horror characters. It's like Freddy Krueger and Michael Myers and the Scream Mask and Hellraiser. Ah, can you see the, the little thumbnail there? Haha, -ha, I'm going to open this. I thought it might be fun to do this and put it on Rick's wall. Because Brooke is a horror freak. She's only 14, but she loves horror films. Yes, I know technically it's illegal, but hey-ho. She doesn't go to the cinema to see them. And she watches them with us. So we have got Freddy Krueger. I'm not sure of the colours. Hopefully it will turn out a bit better. We've got Jason. We've got Michael Myers. I don't know who some of them are, actually. Hellraiser. Oh, that's from... I can't remember. Is it Saw? And there's Chucky. <laughs> so yeah, I thought I would give that a go and do it to put up in Brooke's room. Something a little bit different. It's certainly not Christmas, put it that way. <laughs> and the drills, you can tell the colours. They're all kind of browns and reds and oranges. <laughs> and of course, you get your toolkit. I was going to say Brooke might want to actually do that one herself, but it's too big, she would get bored. She's got no attention span. I've got drills without a toolkit, eh, without a painting. Oh, I think I did buy these because they are special drills. Hold on, I'm going to open them. Now, when I said that I'm going to try to do something different with the diamond paintings, I'm going to try to make my own. So when I saw that they sell the special drills separately, I thought, great idea. I always keep my spare drills. Hello, Willa. Oh, I've got one of my doggies in to see me. Um, 
I always keep my spare drills for doing things like that, but having the nice sparkly ones for Christmas uh, resin, uh, not resin, Christmas diamond paintings is always good. So it looks like, are they slightly bigger maybe? Ooh. So I'll put the details on the screen of how many colours there are and how much it was. But yeah, I do remember ordering them. We have got a wash bag. Don't ask me why. I was either thinking, I mean I've been buying things like this for storage in my craft room. And it is a good size actually, and it's see-through so you can see what's in it. Might be good for certain moulds, but we are also going on holiday in October, so I was maybe thinking about that. But regardless, Tim would do good wash bags, look. <laughs> it, honestly, it is a really good size. I don't know if you can see in there, it expands very, very well. Look, yay. Markers. Whiteboard markers. I don't have a whiteboard. <laughs> Um, I've got a feeling, I remember looking at pens that do something cool in water. I'm not sure if this is them. I'll put the details on the screen. Maybe I did just buy them to try them with resin. I'm not sure. They're nice vibrant colours anyway. Ah, <laughs> this next one. Right, I'm going to turn it this way around. Okay, it's a jumper, it's a hoodie. Now, <laughs> sorry, the dogs have decided to come in here and play. Um, I'm going to give you a bit of background to this, just in case you don't know, uh, don't watch my vlogs. My 14 year old daughter is autistic and she's hyper, she never sits still for more than a minute. And I think um, there's probably a bit of ADHD in there as well because. Quite often, autism and ADHD do come together. Um, <laughs> she's grown up with a wide range of music because, you know, any time we've been in the car for any length of time, we've been listening to music that me and her dad like. And a lot of that's been like uh, rock music, a bit of heavy metal, you know, that sort of thing. And recently she has started playing the guitar. Okay, so she's getting right into some of those bands now. So I don't want to say this out loud because she's in her bed, but I'm going to turn it round and you will see <laughs> the reason why we bought this for her. If you don't know, that is a pun on a band name. And this is based on one of their songs. Okay, I'll put it on the screen for you up. That just is so funny, it's so her. Hi, the... Hey look, there's a squirrel! And uh, yeah, hopefully she'll wear it. I'm going to open it and see what size it is. So I got it in a small man because they didn't have it in kids. And it's got the pocket, which is good. And the hood. And it's fleece lined actually, it feels quite nice. Feels quite warm. Oh, I've got more clothes here. I have been looking at this on the app for a while now because I play the game Fishland, which basically you need to feed fish to get free products. It's so addictive, but it's so frustrating because once you get down to the end, you need to bloom and feed them for a million times before you actually fill them up. But part of that is that you get to browse a page for 45 seconds and I've seen this quite a few times when I was browsing, so I'm going to open it. And I do remember every time I saw it thinking, I like that, I bet that would be lovely, even just for round about the house. So it's black v-neck, then it's got a pink panel, then it's got a grey panel, and it's the same on the sleeves. Now I will try this on and pop a photo in when I'm editing. I'm not sure about the quality though, look. That looks like it could get a hole in it very easily. And the same at that side. Yeah, I'll see what it's like when it's on. I don't even know if it'll fit me. What size did I get it in? 
extra large which I think is a 16 to 18 but it looks like that's been cut out I wonder if this is one that someone sent back I mean it'll be fine just for round about the house anyway I'll pop I'll put it on and then I'll make a decision Timu if you don't know do free delivery which is amazing and they also do free returns for 30 days as well and they don't quibble with you, they just give you your refund. And a lot of the time they'll tell you just to keep the item. Sorry if you're moving about a bit. <laughs> the dogs are now playing right at my wheelchair, so I keep banging into the uh, camera. Next, we've got a notebook. Oh, a weekly planner. No, I do not remember ordering this. <laughs> I do like a weekly planner, I have to say. And I am making a lot more videos now and I'm kind of planning ahead with my videos. So maybe that's what I was thinking about. Um, oh, and it stands. Yay. So each page you've got your seven days. You can circle what month it is and you can circle what week of the month it is. And that looks like bullet points down there. That might be quite handy. You know what I maybe should do? I should maybe keep it at the side of my bed to write down things like make a team, place a team order in the daytime. <laughs> maybe that would be enough to put me back to sleep without actually doing it. Mm. And it looks like it's in different languages as well, the days. Yeah, Monday, Lundi is um, French, isn't it? Lundi, Mardi, Mercredi, Jeudi, Vendredi, Sunday, Dimanche. I remember that from high school. That's not bad going since I'm nearly 48. Okay, puppies. <laughs> That's a husky and the Caucasian Shepherd playing. And then there's other language, which I'm assuming is German. I've never done German, so I'm not even going to attempt to say it in case I butcher it. Ha, that's quite good. And I'm assuming there's going to be 52 of them since there's 52 weeks in the year, but you never know. Ah, look, the other side. Yesterday is history, tomorrow is a mystery, today is a gift. And it's good that you've got a, a bit extra there for notes because the each column isn't really that big. Uh, do they all say that? Yes, they do. Hey! So, I didn't know I needed one of these, but now I've got it, I do. What next? Ooh! It's more... It's black AB. I'm not sure. I think they're actually rhinestones. I think they're maybe hot fix rhinestones rather than diamond painting drills. Yeah. I'll put it on the screen, but I was recently gifted a... Rhinds, hot fix rhinestone gum that basically heats it up and adheres it to whatever sub, uh, surface it is. So I wonder if I thought I would try it with resin. Maybe not with the heat, but yeah, you could. Interesting. Mm. We have got Merry Christmas. Is it? Can't be incense. I don't burn incense. What is? Oh, six pencils for Christmas. Why did I get six Christmas pencils? I have got no idea. <laughs> I wonder if it's maybe to go with something that I'm planning to sell on the stall. I'm not sure. Let's take them out. Oh, they've got rubbers on them. Erasers. They're cute. Merry Christmas. We snowman. Christmas tree. Parcel. Oh, there's Santa down there. And Rudolph. Yay! Actually, they are very cute. Ah. I was probably... Because the other thing that I do through the night when I wake up is I think of things that... Like, unique things that I could make and sell. So, I wonder if I maybe had an idea for that. I'm definitely going to keep this weekly planner beside my bed. <laughs> oh, more diamond painting stickers. Is this the same? Oh no, it can't be, because these are special grills for the... Ah, it was normal grills for the other one. I'm going to open this. I think I might have placed this order the night of the day that I decided I was going to try this thing with the diamond painting. And it's obviously been on my mind and I thought, oh, I'll get them to try it. 
So let's have a look at these stickers. There's not as many of them. This might be the same ones. No, it's not the same ones that I got in a previous haul, I don't think. Yeah, they're nice. And they look nice and easy. Good. One good thing about diamond painting stickers is kids can do them. Um, you know, basically they're small, so they don't need to have a long attention span. And uh, yeah, the kids feel like they've achieved something at the end of it. They're nice. And it's special drills. Quick look at the colours. Oh, there's lots of colours. Oh, wow. I'm going to have loads left over from this. Um, just to quickly show you the difference between normal drills and special drills. So these are normal drills. They are matte in colour, as you can see. And these are special drills because they're sparkly. They're like crystals or rhinestones. Um, and special drills also come in different shapes and sizes as well. Whereas your normal drills are all the same shape and size. Although, not to get too diamond painting on you, you do get round drills and square drills. But if it's like a square drill um, picture you're doing, they'll all be square. If it's a round drill, they'll all be round. So that is the main difference between the two. In case you were wondering what I was talking about when I said plain drills and special drills. And I better not get these mixed up now. <laughs> yeah, cool. I like them. I might do some of these on a craft and chat video, just, you know, diamond painting them as I'm chatting to you. That might be quite nice. Let me know if you fancy that. I think we're coming to the last items. Yeah, this is the last items. I hate it when I have an empty bag. And it's, oh, more nail stickers. Yay! I love nail stickers for in resin. And these are so cute. Are these glow in the dark? I don't think so, but there's some, ah, there's some very white ones, let it snow, a snowflake, let it snow, I love the penguins, I think that's maybe why I got this pack, because I love penguins just now, and then this one, ooh, it's like, pretty Christmas, they're nice, I'm not entirely sure what the oranges and grapefruits have got to do with Christmas. Although, yeah, I suppose you do. You put, like, dried citrus fruit on the tree and things traditionally. And we always have an orange in our stocking, or at least we used to. But then I replaced it with a chocolate orange for the kids because uh, the real orange was never getting eaten. <laughs> ah, so, yeah, I'm going to look forward to using them in my resin. So, that is everything for... <laughs> goodness sake, dog. I'm sorry there's been so many interruptions today. But that is everything for my Timu haul this time. This was my panic buy Timu haul. That, um, yeah, it's very different to my usual purchases, as I'm sure you will agree. Because I was half asleep when I placed the order. <laughs> Note to self, wait till you're awake. <laughs> Although in saying that, there's nothing here that I'm not going to use. I'm just a wee bit dubious about the water bottle and the pencils. They were maybe on a really good deal. I don't know. And the fact that my dream about a pulse oximeter was actually real life is quite freaky. <laughs> anyway, yes, Hugo, I agree. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this haul. If so, please do hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe to me if you haven't already and ring that little bell so that you get notified every time I put a video up. Uh, most Tuesdays seem to be Timu Tuesdays just now. I seem to have a haul pretty much every week. Thanks to the fact that I'm an influencer with Timu now, so they do give me free products from time to time. But again, I have paid with these with my own pennies. Um, I also do vlogs on a Monday and a Thursday. I do a crafty video most Wednesdays. And any other thing that just comes to my mind, I will put up on my channel as well. And please talk to me in the comments below. Do you ever do that? Do you ever place an order in the middle of the night and then think, what did I buy? <laughs> please let me know I'm not the only one. <laughs> right, I'm going to head off now. Thanks so much, everybody. I will see you in our next one. Bye.